there are some potentially major scientific and fossil discoveries happening in this paleontology lab in Kenosha. Paleontologists and amateur scientists unearthed a rarely seen fossil, a juvenile Tyrannosaurus rex. Among the most scientifically important fossils that we found since we started in 2006. Over the summer, a group of researchers from Carthage College in Kenosha went on a fossil hunting trip to Montana. During the second to last day of the trip, a volunteer brought a bag of fossils to the leader of the group, Dr. Thomas Carr. Turns out, it was a bag of T-Rex fossils. Very lucky to have found, to have found a juvenile T-Rex. Um, like, literally, I can count the best specimens on one hand. There's like five of them. Now those fossils are in a paleontology lab beneath the Dinosaur Discovery Museum in Kenosha. To be clear, they aren't fossils that look like this. They found bits of an ankle and vertebrae and fossil fragments. So for me, when I look at something like this and these fossils, kind of crazy to hold this fossil, by the way, uh, it just looks like a rock. But to them, they've got the trained eye and they know what to look for. This grooved texture is really the dead giveaway for what Triceratops Fro looks like. You say the dead giveaway and I'm just thinking, ah, I couldn't, I would have no clue. The paleontology lab has a team of people going through the fossil fragments, trying to piece together this prehistoric creature. Once they put it together, they will document the specimen and place it in their storage closet full of fossils they have found over the years of digging in Montana. And so we are gradually building up a library of fossils that we can then tell the greater story of our area and the animals in it. This room full of fossils that Carthage College has collected to me kind of symbolizes that thrill of the hunt as well as our ongoing quest to put together the pieces of our Earth's history. In Kenosha, James Grow, TMJ4 News.